My name is Dr. Alina Banerjee. I'm the clinical director of the MGH Allergy and Immunology Clinic. I'm gonna be speaking with my colleague, Dr. Kim Blumenthal, an expert in vaccine allergy, about your most frequently asked questions about COVID-19 vaccine allergy. And we hope to give you some answers as to when you should see your allergist. Hi, I'm Kim Blumenthal. I'm an allergist and researcher who focuses on drug and vaccine allergy at Mass General Hospital. Dr. Blumenthal, can you tell me a little bit about what is vaccine allergy? Similarly to how you can be allergic to food or medications, you can be allergic to vaccines. The symptoms of vaccine allergy can start within minutes of getting a vaccination. The symptoms often include the skin, such as itching, rash, or hives, and the respiratory symptoms with shortness of breath, chest tightness, or wheezing. Can you tell us a little bit about what other vaccine allergy reactions can occur? Some individuals get rashes after a vaccine, and the rashes can be a variety of different causes and severity and locations. Sometimes with rashes after vaccination, we think that it's actually the body's immune response to the vaccination causing the rash rather than an allergy. But some rashes might represent a type of allergy or hypersensitivity. Vaccines can also cause local reactions and those local reactions can appear immediately after getting the vaccine or even a week after vaccination. Now local reactions, even if they are large, red and swollen, are not a form of vaccine allergy. Are allergic reactions to the COVID-19 vaccines common? Allergic symptoms after receiving a messenger RNA COVID-19 vaccine, such as the one from Pfizer-BioNTech or Moderna, can occur in up to 2% of individuals. But severe allergic reactions, like anaphylaxis, is exceedingly rare, and it occurs in just 7 per million first doses. This means that Although it's possible to have some allergic symptoms after your COVID-19 vaccine, severe allergic reactions are very uncommon. Dr. Blumenthal, if I have a food or drug allergy, do I have to avoid the COVID-19 vaccines? Patients with a history of allergies, even anaphylaxis, can receive the COVID-19 vaccines. But for patients who've had a history of anaphylaxis in the past, Generally, we recommend an observation time after getting your vaccination of 30 minutes. Many people with a history of severe allergic reactions have now been safely vaccinated. One study in, recently published in Israel with only highly allergic individuals found that 98% of them tolerated their vaccine without any allergic reaction. And the 2% that had allergic reactions, generally the symptoms were mild. We also did a study using our own employees at Mass General Brigham, and we similarly found that although allergic symptoms were commonly reported, anaphylaxis was rare even in individuals who had a history of anaphylactic reactions. Which patients should consider seeing an allergist before they get their COVID-19 vaccine? Patients who have a history of an inactive ingredient allergy. And those inactive ingredients that we're specifically concerned about are polyethylene glycol or PEG or polysorbate. And finally, if you've had a prior allergic reaction to a COVID-19 vaccine. We hope that this question and answer session about COVID-19 vaccine allergy answered your most commonly asked questions. You can always go to our website for the MGH Allergy and Immunology Clinic for additional information. Thank you.